Welcome to CSE Guru. In this session, we will discuss n quince problem using backtracking technique. In the previous session, we have discussed about the concept of backtracking technique. What is backtracking and what is state space tree in backtracking? Everything we have discussed. I will provide the link in the description for your reference. So here, backtracking is nothing but the problem starts with the initial state. And proceed with all possible solutions by satisfying the problem constraint. Given problem constraint, always we need to consider. Okay, by considering the problem constraint, consider the next level components. And these and all will be considered as the partially constructed solution. Okay, suppose by considering these partially constructed solution, if it is able to provide solution in the sense, you can continue. In any level, if it reached a dead end, by considering this partially constructed solution, we cannot able to continue to provide the feasible solution in the sense of stop here and backtrack to the previous level and try the other possibility to provide the feasible solution by considering the problem constraint. Suppose if this is also dead end in the sense, backtrack to the previous level. If this is also dead end in the sense, backtrack to the previous level. Likewise, the technique works to provide the feasible solution by considering the problem constraints. And the backtracking technique can be implemented with the help of the state space tree. This is nothing but the state space tree. And this state space tree initially starts with the initial node and proceed to the next level component to provide the feasible solution. So this is nothing but the state space tree. And this state space tree we can able to implement with the help of the DFS search. That is depth first search. With the help of the backtracking technique, we can implement this n quince problem. Problem is place n quince on n into n chessboard so that no two queens attack each other. Okay, so this is the problem constraint. No two queens attack each other by being in the same row, same column, same diagram. That is, if you are placing one queen in the sense, same row, same column and same diagonal, you should not place the another queen. That is the constraint here. So we need to place n queens on n by n chessboard. So here design, if you are considering in the sense, this is a four into four queen problem. Here they have provided four rows and four columns. Okay. And each queen should be placed in one row. Four queens should be placed in four rows such that same row, same column, same diagonal. You should not place the another queen. That is the constraint. Okay. For example, consider this four into four chessboard. Initially, I will start with the initial state solution. So this is the initial state solution. One into one, one comma two, one comma three, one comma four. Likewise, in order we have to consider. Okay, first I can place the queen in 1, 1. Okay, first row, first column I have placed with the queen. And here if we are considering in the sense, same row, same column and same diagonal, you should not place another queen. Okay, that is the logic. So second choice is I can place the queen here. Next possibility in order if you are considering, I can place here. Then same row, same column and same diagonal. I cannot able to place the another point. Next, what is the next possibility? I can able to place the queen here. And if you are placing this queen here, same row, same column, same diagonal, you should not place another queen. Next, if you are considering, there is no other choices to place the fourth queen. Okay? So, this is a dead end. We have reached a dead end. It does not proceed to provide the feasible solution. Okay? So, try the other possibility. Now, we have considered 1, 1. Then try with 1, 2. Then the same row, same column and the same diagonal. You should not place the other queen. Now, first queen we have placed. The second queen possibility is 2, 1 and 2, 4. Try with 2, 1. We have placed with the queen in 2, 1. Same row, same column. You should not place the other queen. In same diagonal also, you should not place the other queen. Next possibility is... I can able to place the queen here. But if you are placing the queen here, same row, same column and the same diagonal, you should not place the other queen. So we can able to place only three queens. Fourth queen, there is no place. Second row, if you are considering, there are two possibilities. Okay, we have tried this possibility. Try with the other possibility, this one. So first queen, we are placing in one comma two. The same column, same row and same diagonal, you should not place the other queen. 
and second possibility if you are considering in the sense 2 comma 1 and 2 comma 4. Previously we have tried with the 2 comma 1. Now try with the 2 comma 4 and place it when in 2 comma 4. The same row, same column and same diagonal. You should not place the next point. Okay. Third point where we can place only one possibility that is 3 comma 1. So place the point in 3 comma 1. Same row, same column, same diagonal. You should not place the other point. Then fourth row if you are considering there is one possible place here. We can able to place the fourth point here. So place the point here. And the same row and the same column and same diagonal if you are considering in the sense. There is no other point. Okay. So, this is nothing but the feasible solution. Okay. So, if you are considering same row, same column, same diagonal, there is no two points. Okay. So, with the help of this backtracking technique, we have provided the solution by considering the problem constraint. No two points attack each other in same row, same column and same diagonal. We have provided the solution. Okay, for this one more solution is also possible. First queen we are placing in 1 comma 3, second queen we are placing in 2 comma 1 and third queen we are placing in 3 comma 4 and the fourth queen we are placing in 4 comma 2. This is also possible. Here also no two queens attack each other in same row, same column, same diagonal. This is second solution. This is first solution and this is second solution. So more than one feasible solution is possible by considering the problem constraint. Okay. So, this is nothing but n points problem. And this n points problem, we are going to implement with the help of backtracking technique. Thank you for watching this video.